Welcome to this course on Epson Device Admin Software. Throughout this session, we'll learn about the added value that this fleet management system can bring to Epson's business customers with full remote control, including the ability to install, configure, monitor, maintain, and troubleshoot your Epson network devices for increased productivity and cost savings. Please note that Epson Device Admin is compatible with Windows Client and Windows Server systems to fit requirements from any company size. When businesses grow, not only is there a great deal of pressure on departments such as HR or logistics, but there are substantial challenges for IT too, and anyone procuring or setting up new equipment, specifically new technology. Let's take an example. A London-based company decides to set up a Paris office. They want their 100 new printers in Paris to work exactly like their 300 printers in London. This is difficult when the job of the Paris IT manager is stretched with other IT related issues. It may mean the company needs to hire extra staff or the current IT manager has to work overtime. Once the units have been installed, the IT manager must maintain the printers and spend time monitoring and checking each individual unit for device or supply status. This is another time consuming task in an already full schedule. These hidden or often overlooked costs of having staff install and maintain technology like printers, together with a lack of clarity on how much printers are being used and for what, can lead to high costs for a growing business, both in terms of value and time spent. Epson knows about these challenges that businesses face and has a powerful software solution that enables businesses to easily organize your device fleet, maximize productivity, keep costs low, and save time so that you can keep on growing. We do this with Epson Device Admin, a powerful piece of software for remote fleet management that simplifies the way businesses install, maintain, and use printers in the office, no matter where in the world the IT manager happens to be. Epson Device Admin is available for free to all of Epson's business customers and is a key value add. It works with fleets containing as few as 10 devices and as many as thousands. The interface is intuitive and easy to use. There are four main areas of functionality, devices, alerts, reports and configuration. Let's look at each in turn. Keeping track of a fleet of devices can be difficult. This is even harder if the business is spread across multiple offices or even has multiple premises. It's hard to know exactly which piece of hardware sits where, which devices are used the most, and which machines have needed maintenance. This process becomes a long and inefficient manual task for the IT manager. But with Epson Device Admin, not only will the software discover all Epson printers immediately, but you can group printers together so that you can see everything from the big picture of your whole fleet right the way down to buildings, floors and separate offices. Let's see how easy it is to group printers together. On the menu ribbon at the top of the page, click on the Group tab. Click on the New Group button and select Paris Office. Enter A3MFP to create the new group and click OK. The group has now appeared within the defined list of groups. Highlight the printers required for the Paris office and simply drag and drop these printers to the newly created A3MFP group. To confirm that your action has been completed, select A3MFP from the All Groups navigation pane on the right-hand side of the window and review the printers added to the list. With a fleet of network devices to maintain, an IT manager's already busy schedule can fill up even more. Sometimes the work required could be done by a non-specialised employee. Sometimes there are unresponsive devices that go unnoticed. Sometimes an IT manager isn't available to carry out the maintenance. All this costs the company in money, time and lost productivity. Epson Device Admin makes network devices maintenance easy, allowing an IT manager to maximise their time and arrange maintenance quickly and efficiently. Device Admin does this by allowing the user to set up alerts. 
a non-specialised employee can be assigned tasks such as refilling the printer with paper or ink. Normally there'll be one employee in charge of a group of printers per type of alert. This frees up valuable time for IT staff and gets printers up and running with minimal disruption. And sometimes there aren't even IT staff in the country, so someone has to contact the local country and arrange for the printer to be looked at, the ink changed or a service arranged. As soon as a printer develops a fault, it sends an alert to the IT manager. Depending on the location of the printer, the IT manager can arrange to fix the issue themselves or they can arrange for someone local to fix the printer, minimising the printer downtime for the company and allowing them to maximise their productivity. And it's really easy to set up an alert. All you need is an email address. Click on the Alerts tab and click on the New Alerts button. Select the type of alert, in this case Paper Out, and enter the alert description in the appropriate text field. You can add additional information and text for recipients of this alert. To view the completed alert, click on the unsubscribed alerts item in the navigation pane on the right hand side of the window. Click on the menu ribbon to assign this alert to a specific group, in this case the A3MFP group, and click OK. John Smith will now receive an alert when a device from the Paris A3MFP group has a paper out. These days, each business department is allocated a budget, and in a bid to keep costs low, Budgets are monitored closely and savings are made where possible. Knowing how efficiently a department uses its printers or how much of their budget should be allocated to printing resources is a time-consuming and complicated process and consequently exact figures are sometimes difficult to get hold of. This means that potential savings are missed and the company could be over or underspending significantly on printing resources. But with Epson Device Admin, a daily, weekly, monthly or quarterly report of device use by group is sent to the person in charge. It gives detailed information on device usage, such as total pages, total colour and monochrome pages and duplex prints. This gives the Chief Information Officer and IT Manager the information they need to create an accurate printing resource budget for each department, allowing the company to save costs in the long run. The reports are easy to access and are an invaluable tool for any company. See how easy it is to set up a report. On the menu ribbon, click on the Reports tab and click New. A new window will open. Select the device usage within the drop-down menu. Click Next. Select Paris A3 MFP and click Next. Select Simplex and Duplex from the data field. There will be five fields in total selected. Total pages, colour pages, mono pages, simplex pages and duplex pages. Click Next. Select your month and click Next. Tick Email and Archive and click Select from History. Choose John Smith as the recipient of this report. Type in an email subject like Paris Monthly Report. Click Next. Confirm the subject of the report. Select Weekly and Monday. Click Next and then click OK. The report will automatically be sent to John Smith's mailbox every Monday. One of the most time consuming tasks for an IT manager is setting up a new fleet of printers. To take our example from before, our new Paris-based IT manager needs to set up each of the 100 new printers manually. This is time consuming and highly costly for a company. But Epson Device Admin turns this costly and tedious task into a few clicks of a mouse. With the Epson Device Admin configuration template, all you ever need to do is set up one device. You can then copy the settings into the template and apply them to the rest of the printers in your fleet. This means our IT manager in London can choose one of the devices in his fleet in the London office and a few minutes later all the units in Paris are configured to the same settings. 
This makes it easy to expand a print fleet and grow it as the business grows. Look how easy it is to apply a configuration template onto a whole fleet of printers. On the menu ribbon, click on the configuration tab. Click the new button. When the new window opens, enter the template name, template for Paris devices. Update the template with your preferences. In this case, we want to select language change, update timeout, USB parameter, Click Save and click OK to save the changes. The template will appear in the Templates area. Select the newly created template. Review the newly created settings and click Apply on the menu ribbon. A new window is now being displayed. In it, select Groups and select Paris A3 MFP and click Assign to apply the changes. Epson knows about the challenges that businesses face and has a powerful solution to enable businesses to easily organise your device fleet, maximise productivity, keep your costs low and save time so that you can keep on growing. Thank you for watching this presentation from Epson. For more information, head over to epson.eu forward slash EDA.